controversial Joe Rogan mimicked the Queen's voice and called Meghan Markle a little American hussy who would make Prince Harry a Kardashian in an unearthed podcast episode. Rogan is the host of a Spotify-exclusive podcast, The Joe Rogan Experience, and has come under fire recently having appeared to promote an anti-vax conspiracy theorist on his show. This has resulted in Harry and Meghan weighing in, with the couple releasing a statement saying that they would continue working with the streaming service. However, with Harry having been publicly critical of the impact of internet trolls in the past, the statement also acknowledged the work they had been doing to tackle a global misinformation crisis. Some fans were unhappy with this response, claiming they saw the Sussexes as hypocrites for failing to cancel their reportedly lucrative deal with Spotify. Now, an unearthed podcast episode has drawn a link between Rogan and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex before the pandemic had even begun. In an old episode, Joe and his guest were speaking shortly after Harry and Meghan had abdicated their royal responsibilities in early 2020. Discussing the news, Rogan mimicked a spoof of the Queen's voice, saying, It's that little American hussy he's hooked up with. She's going to turn him into a Kardashian. That little American hussy has ruined my prince. The host and his guest Mike Baker went on to chat about how the royals are funded in the UK and commented on where Harry and Meghan might end up, having stepped down from royal duties. This comes as royal commentators have been speculating over what the next move for Harry and Meghan's podcast production might be. So far, the couple have only released one episode on the platform, prompting reports that Spotify has taken the project into its own hands. And, a royal commentator has claimed, this might mean fans will see the platform use the couple as Kardashians with crowns and create content about their time in the royal family. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have come under fire for trying to stick their beaks into someone else's fight and even got branded the labelled Prince and Princess of Cancellation. This call-out against Prince Harry and Meghan Markle has been issued by British journalist Brendan O'Neill. He accused the couple of sticking their beaks into the Spotify row and told Sky News Australia, I am shocked by this whole situation, we have these hippies for censorship like Neil Young and more recently Joni Mitchell, who are basically calling on a massive corporation to ditch Joe Rogan because they don't like him. And of course, Harry and Meghan have to stick their beak in. There has never been a woke bandwagon they haven't tried to jump on, and now they are getting involved too. Mr. O'Neill went on to accuse the pair of aspiring to be the prince and princess of cancellation as he shared his frustration at their intervention. Mr. O'Neill further shared his frustrations and added, they've always wanted to control how people think and they now see an opportunity to do that through Spotify. Even though they've never even made any podcast for Spotify, they got paid a lot of money for not doing much at all. With Prince Harry and Meghan Markle launching a partnership with Spotify in 2020, the Royal Couples Foundation revealed the concerns the Duke and Duchess reported to the streaming platform over Rogan's misinformation around the coronavirus pandemic. Since the inception of Artual, we have worked to address the real-time global misinformation crisis, an Artual spokesperson said. Hundreds of millions of people are affected by the serious harms of rampant mis- and disinformation every day.